hello everyone welcome to incredible study today in this video we are going to solve one proof that of trigonometry so without getting delay let's get into it here you can see this is our question we have if p q and r are the angles of a triangle p q r prove that two times sin q by 2 plus sin r by 2 times sin q by 2 minus sin r by 2 minus cos p is equal to 1 minus 4 cos p by 2 into cos q by 2 into sin r by 2 this is our question and here this is our given lhs and we have to prove this rhs 1 minus 4 cos p by 2 into cos q by 2 into cos into sin r by 2 so here we are going to solve this question so we solve it from lhs from lhs we have given sin q by 2 plus sin r by 2 times sin q by 2 minus sin r by 2 minus cos p this is our lhs now in second step we we'll use the formula of sin c plus sin d what is the formula of sin c plus sin d this is sin c plus sin d then we have formula 2 sin c plus d by 2 into cos c minus c minus d by 2 this is d this is our formula of sin c plus sin d and sin c minus sin d we have sin c minus sin d 2 cos c plus d by 2 c plus d by 2 into sin c minus d by 2 just inverse of this and here we use these two formula to solve this question here we have we write 2 and we use the formula of sin c considering this term c and this term d considering this q by 2 as c and r by 2 as d we solve this then we get here 2 sin q plus r by 4 into cos q minus r by 4 and similarly just enclose it in bracket and we use the formula of this sin c minus sin d then we get here 2 cos c plus d by 4 by 2 by 2 means by 4 we can write here and here sin c minus d by 4 minus cos p we write here And in next step we write here 2 you can see here match the term here this 2 sin sin q plus r by 4 and here cos here cos q plus we have to write here q plus r instead of this q plus r here we write q minus r you can see here this sin q plus r by 4 the angle of this cos and sin are same q plus that is q plus r by 4 and here q minus r by 4 and q minus r by 4 so we arrange it in formula here we write here 2 sin q plus r by 4 into we bring this cos here then we write here cos q plus r by 4 and again 2 as it is and then we use we bring this sign here we write sin q minus r by 4 and we bring this cos r q minus r by 4 here then we can write here cos q minus r by 4 
now you can see here and at last q cos p now you can see here this is the formula of 2 sin a into cos a 2 sin b into cos b just consider this as b and this as a then what we can see here this is in the formula of 2 sin a into cos a then we can write here we have formula of 2 sin a into cos a that is sin 2a here we write sin 2 and instead of a we have this much q plus r by 4 and here again this we use this formula we write the formula for this then we write here sin 2 and instead of b we have q minus r by 4 minus cos p as it is now we write here this 2 2 and this 2 2 cancel then we write here 2 sin q plus r by 2 into sin q minus r by 2 and here we use the formula for this cos p that is 2 here this is the formula the formula of cos 2a is equal to 2 cos square a minus 1 this is one formula that we are going to use here and we consider this p as 2a we consider this p as 2a then we write formula for this here you can see if here is 2a then we write half of this 2a that is a and if we consider this p as 2a then half of p we write here p by 2 in formula and here we write formula that is 2 cos square p by 2 and when we multiply the minus 1 by minus then we get plus 1 and here we write here you can see when we derive and we have angle p plus angle q plus angle r is equal to 180 degree just divide all side by 2 then we get here we get p by 2 plus q by 2 plus r by 2 is equal to 90 degree and here we can write this 90 degree minus p by 2 and now we operate here sin because we have here q plus r by 2 in sin 1 so we here operate sin and then we get here sin q plus r by 2 is equal to cos p by 2 sin 90 degree minus p by 2 is equal to cos p by 2 that is sin 90 minus theta is equal to cos theta we write here now we write its next step that is we replace this sin q plus r by 2 with cos p by 2 then we get here cos p by 2 into sin q minus r by 2 minus 2 cos square p by 2 plus 1 and here for next step we just drop this now we solve remaining one here remaining we solve here the next step we write here we take common this 2 cos p by 2 and here also 2 cos p by 2 then we take common here 2 cos p by 2 and then we write here the remaining sin q minus r by 2 here we write sin q minus r by 2 minus this minus and here 1 since there here is square cos square p by 2 then 1 cos p by 2 is remaining so we write here 1 cos p by 2 here and this bracket close and plus 1 we write here now we write this plus 1 here in front and there are 2 cos p by 2 
and the formula we use here sin c minus sin d then we get here what is our formula 2 cos q minus r and in here we write here we replace this cos with sin 1 that is here this is before that let's write one more step that is sin q minus r by 2 and minus sin q plus r by 2 we replace this cos p by 2 with sin q plus r by 2 and here plus 1 we have written now we use formula 2 cos p by 2 and then we use the formula of for this sin c minus sin d that is 2 cos c plus d by 2 into sin c minus d by 2 here we use formula 2 cos q minus r plus q plus r this is c and here by 2 we write by 2 means it becomes by 4 into sin c minus d sin here for c we have this one then we write here q minus r and for d we write q minus r here and by 4 this here in this rr cancel and in this qq cancel then we write here 1 plus 2 this 2 into 2 4 we write directly cos p by 2 and here cos q plus q by 4 that is cos 2q by 4 then 2 to cancel and then we can directly write here cos q by 2 and here sine here we have sine minus r by 2 minus r by 2 and this is minus this minus r plus minus r that is minus 2r by 4 2 to cancel minus r by 2 and sine minus theta is equal to minus sine theta so for here we write minus here we put here minus directly because they all are single term so we write here sine that is r by 2 this is our proved here you can see this is the proof of this question in eight step we have solved this question so this is the solution for this question for today only this much and i will catch you up in the next one